my name is Kevin O'Leary. Today, I will demo Intel VTune Amplifier, a powerful performance analysis tool that accurately detects hotspots in your code down to the line level. And the best part of it is it can profile Python code with calls to native extensions. This single tool does it all. Note, I'm showing VTune on Windows in Visual Studio, but it can also run standalone on Linux or Windows. Here is our Python and Cython code that simulates an application doing a lot of number crunching. You'll note that it does some C functions, albeit implemented in Cython for readability. Let's profile it in VTune. Click on New Amplifier Result. The first thing you'll notice is a checkbox that says Inherit Settings from Visual Studio Project. Make sure this box is unchecked. Next, make sure your application is set to be Python. Your application parameters should be pointing at your Python script. Set your working directory to be the place where your Python program exists. Make sure you change your managed code profiling mode from native to auto. Next, I click choose analysis and click basic hotspots from the list of analysis types on the left. Then I click start. v will run your application. Unlike many profilers that use high overhead instrumentation, which can distort the result, v uses very low overhead sampling that gives accurate results. As you can see from the summary view, the program took eight seconds to run. Click on the bottom up tab. The bottom up view will show us the top bottlenecks in our program. The top one in our list is a C function. By double clicking the C function, it will bring up the source view. I'm going to pretend that this function is very important. The algorithm is very complex and I cannot fix it. Let's go back to our Python code to find out why it was called in the first place. I'm going to look at the call stack on the right. The first function that looks interesting to us is, is called inside of main.py in a function called do log. I didn't expect do log to be calling our top hotspot. Do log was merely supposed to put out logging information. And it highlights the line where my C function was called. As you can see, it's called from the line that is highlighted. Now I can double click that line and be right back in the Python code. We can check the documentation for the logging module and see what we are doing here is incorrect. What we need to do is simply make logging lazy instead of eager so that it would only format strings when we are logging something. So now I'm going to fix this by removing the dot format. This will make the logging lazy. Now I click save and I'm ready to do another result. Since I have everything set up already, all I need to do now is click start. Now, after my analysis runs, I can see that my program now only takes four seconds. It's twice as fast now. I close all the open results and I select the results on the left. And then I do a right click compare and press the compare button. Now I can see my do work function is completely gone. The calc pi function has almost no change. So I can see my program indeed ran four seconds faster as this elapsed time shows. To summarize, Intel v Amplifier is a great tool to begin understanding and improving the performance of your code. It can profile Python and native mixed code and will accurately detect the exact line that causes issues. Setting up VTune is easy and the different modes help you get details at various levels of depth and precision. Thank you for watching the video. For more information, click on the links in the description below.